Cullen's tunnel was right where I was told it would be. I haven't been in the Keeper compound since my trial. It's a sprawling complex right in the heart of the city, hidden by glyphs. Orland has the compound on alert, so they'll be armed and ready for intruders. Me, that is. So much for working together. I know I didn't kill Katika, but someone did and my money's on Orland. He fixed the trial and sent the assassins after me and the fallen clock tower points right to his office. Brethren and betrayer suddenly makes sense. But suspicions aren't enough, so tonight I'll do some snooping. And if a little keeper wealth ends up in my pockets, all the better. Orland's place is on the top floor. No surprise, he's always liked looking down on people. Artemis has a room near the dormitories. I should search there, too. And I'd better check the scene of Katika's murder. One last thing. The Keeper Council meets tonight. If I can stay awake, I might learn something. been centuries, has it not? 278 years, Keeper Vorig. I read my histories. Though, of course, there have been the unexplained disappearances. The Council must respond to this. Quickly. And decisively. Come, let us take our places. And when the vote comes, I trust you will step forward with me to be counted. We will need every vote in favor we can muster. Attendance in the Council is lacking. Wonder what they have left to decide. <laughs> Maybe I can persuade a few keepers to vote my way. That wasn't a noise, was it? Oh! Noise? Huh? What was that? is quiet now, and I have much to do. Huh? <laughs> Should not let myself be so easily distracted. Keepers, many of us are called elsewhere this night, but for those that remain, I now bring this council to order. The question we consider first is whether access to Katika's chambers shall be prescribed. Shall we remove a guard from the Grand Hall and set him to guard the scene of Interpreter Katika's murder? A guard will hardly stop Garrett, and will only cause trouble for our own work. The violence in the city is growing. We need not add to it by arming our own against each other. Well spoken, all. Weigh all that you have heard, and all that you know in consideration. Remember, a majority vote is needed to take action. If your vote is to be yes, you must step forward and be counted. If your vote is to be no, remain unseen in your alcove. 
And the question before us is, do you wish to have Catechus Chambers guarded? Keepers, make your decisions known now. The decision of the Council is no. The guard shall remain at his post in the Grand Hall. The second issue at hand concerns some books in the Elder Libraries which may shed light on the unwritten times. A proposal has been made to bring these precious volumes upstairs to the Hall of Scribes for further study, and where, under many watchful eyes, we might ensure the safety of these valuable chronicles. It is no secret that there have been disappearances. So, shall these books be moved to the Hall of Scribes? The only reasonable vote is for the safety of these precious books. They must be moved. The books are fragile and will not stand the move or harsh treatment. They've been safe up until now. They should remain where they are. Thank you for all your words. Weigh all that you have heard and all that you know in consideration. And the question before us is, should the books in the Elder's Library be brought to the more populated scribe room for study? The decision of the Council is no. The volumes in question shall remain in the Elder's Library and for study at some later time. If there is no further business, we shall adjourn. Did I hear... <clears throat> It happened again. What happened? Two of the scribes. They had to be given the afternoon off to convalesce. The glyphs, you mean? What were they scribing? Nothing of great import. Sepalon and the aphorisms. The aphorisms? Those are hardly even worth practicing penmanship on. There is more at work here than I supposed. Who is the master? The scribe who writes the glyph? Or the glyph who seeks a scriber. Do not speak so. I am master over the glyphs I use, surely. Clearly someone is here, but where?
Hmm? Oh.